Hello, our friends, Evolutionary Energy Arts family. This is a Patreon exclusive we did this morning after meditation. Uh, Cindy got some information that came through that we're sharing over there on Patreon. We want to thank Christopher and Caverly, our two newest Patreons. Again, you could join our Patreon family uh, for less than $1 menu item a month, basically, and exclusive videos each week. Ukraine's former military commander-in-chief has said that the direct involvement of Russia's autocratic allies in its war on Ukraine means that World War III has started. This is a ex-top general. I think a lot of people would agree. Um, what you have is that hypersonic missile strike, which we talked about yesterday uh, is stated to be a warning to the West that these could be used in other countries, specifically Poland. Uh, Poland is now mentioned by Moscow as the Kremlin warns that it can strike the U.S. base there using advanced weapons as NATO scrambles jets and, you know, we see that use of those hypersonic missiles for the first time. Meanwhile, a high-ranking North Korean general was just injured in Ukraine. In Ukraine. And of course, the st storm shadows uh, from the UK have been used as well as uh, the U.S. Atticums. So, you know, what we do have is obviously they are still very, very intent on starting the WW hashtag number three. Police officers carried out a controlled explosion outside the U.S. Embassy in London after a suspicious package was found. And then we have this from Greg Abbott, uh, directing Texas state agencies to fully divest portfolios from China. If any agency has investments in China, they are required to divest at the first available opportunity. Ah, uh, yes, you know, obviously what, what is going on here is, you know, the, the lines are being drawn. And when does the big blow happen is really the question I think everybody is wondering. And, uh, you know, it seems obvious that it will be before Inauguration Day. So within the next two months, could be any day. Breaking here, Turkey promises to counter Yemen's Houthis. In response to the attack on a cargo ship Anatolia Sea, we are sending six warships to counter and suppress uh, the Yemeni Houthis. Now, it's interesting to watch what's going on because uh, Turkey has been very critical of Israel. Turkey is a member of NATO, yet it has also bought weapons from, from Russia. So, yeah, as we've uh, said for years, Turkey is a real wild card. And this is somebody posting a daily reminder, uh, <laughs> chip in your brain, El Elyon supports, you know, certain things, uh, certain things, ouch. Yes, chips, of course, transhumanism, yes, and carbon tax, as you could see by the, uh, all the tweets that people have saved. So do you really think he is a savior? Well, the whole concept of savior is one that sets us up uh, to get into trouble. And that's just the reality of it. As long as we are looking for somebody else to fix the situation, the situation is not going to remain fixed. It's up to us. And as I told you, every single week, he has to just tweet about the population collapse due to plummeting birth rates. Again, again, sperm decline, infertility, miscarriages, etc., 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 South Korea, lowest fertility rate in the region. National security issue, U.S. record low fertility rate. As per CDC data, England, Wales, fertility rates hit new low. Obviously, the environmental factors, what we're eating, uh, how we treat our issues in relation to how we feel. All these things are contributing, as well as environmental factors that we can't control ourselves unless we could vacuum the atmosphere. Ah, uh, here you go. Each rocket, this is from El Elyon again, each rocket engine produces twice as much thrust as all four engines on a Boeing 747, and there are 33 of them. Just a coincidence. Just a coincidence. Why did he pick 33? 
Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Four times the thrust, 33. Oh, time, four times 33 is what, guys? And uh, we start thinking about all the multiples at 12 and the 144,000, the 12 tribes, the 12 apostles, 12 months. I mean, it, it's again all the symbolism that is overwhelming at times for those that pay attention. Mystery Orb zooms past Manhattan in Fox Chopper footage. This is not the first time this has happened. This is multiple times, of course. We have Avi Loeb, who has uh, suggested that it's likely an optical artifact from helicopter glass. Yeah, yeah, that's all. It's just, a, it's just an artifact zooming by at a rapid rate of speed. Sure, sure. But the thing is, I mean, is an artifact uh, from glass that we caught, we shared with you one uh, when we were in, um, let's just say, the greater L.A. area visiting a friend. There was one just like it uh, that basically missed my head by inches. But I didn't think it, I don't think it really wanted to hit me. We've caught them out in the Nevada desert, too. Neither case were we behind any sort of glass. No, and you have countless orb photos. It's, again, the system thinking that we're much more uh, stupid than we really are, at least most. And this is up in Alaska. Somebody said that this does look like the Black Knight satellite. Yeah, it does have a little bit of that shape to it. Uh, it could be the Wicked Witch of the West. Uh, it could be Nancy Pelosi if she found her her broom. Uh, you know, could be a lot of things. Why do we have no clear footage of UFOs? Well, how about this one? This is from 1996. How about this one? This is 2010. This is in Mexico, 92. And this one's from 1993 curious yeah and in reality there there are it's just the fact that a lot of people just don't want to look at a certain thing you know meanwhile here he is el el Yon, citizens of earth give us your memes why does he choose what looks to be an alien invasion or who knows maybe they're friendly and they're just saying hey welcome to the neighborhood you guys woke up about time why did why did pre-columbian uh, indigenous people <clears throat> make these earrings I don't know uh, lapel pins they certainly look a lot like our space shuttles do they not that's curious you know thousands of years ago they made these things how about Egyptian hieroglyphics with a saucer right in the middle of it nothing to see here oh no there's there's nothing going on here everything is is okay but make sure that you get exercise and take your loved ones and your family out for exercise as, as well. Look at this guy. He's dancing up a storm. As always, guys, we look forward to your comments. Come join us on the Patreon channel. Source bless and namaste.